Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Yeah. What's up everybody? So uh, yeah, I finally can get up in my attic, cleaned out this space, well, organized it a little bit better. Um, and cleaned up this area over here as well. And get the stuff a lot better. And we can actually see the water heater. So yeah, happy about that. Definitely happy about that. But anyway, today's working day. Uh, the plan was to go to the big box store, probably Home Depot, maybe Lowe's, and get some more uh, bag dirt um, and just put on the side over here. But after looking at it this morning and you know taking surveillance of everything, <clears throat> the sand that we had back put back there, so there's no corrosion or erosion underneath the concrete, uh, started sweeping away. So I started looking at it this morning. And I was like, we can still use this sand. And instead of telling you about it, I'll go over and show you right now. So you see all down there, it's starting to road away and get under the concrete over here as well. <clears throat> so what I'm doing is I'm using the same sand that we have here and bringing it back up, compacting it down and having it drop off at an angle. Because when we put this concrete driveway in, when we put this in, everything flows back and back here and back into this corner. That's why I put that drain back there. So here's what I'm doing right now. Um, the main point is that it doesn't drop down past the concrete anymore. And we feel, I feel, that sloping it like that, compacting it really well will help. And, with me compacting it at 230 pounds, it's gonna be fine. So I'm gonna get back to work. Hey, what's up guys? I uh, took a little break. Uh, get some water took multiple breaks it is humid out here and i'm drenched but um it's going really well uh i think it's going to be kind of hard to place grass on this in some spots we may have to get some extra dirt just to kind of bring it up but it looks a lot better than it did a lot better Now we got a couple low spots and that's fine. That's fixable with uh, some more dirt, but uh, I'm hoping this does the trick. So what I'm doing a little bit at a time, so I'll do, I don't know, 50 foot sections, maybe 20 foot sections, and then I'll come with the hose and just mist it, mist it down just to compact it a little bit more. Uh, like I said before, I'm 230 pounds and I'm stepping on this and compacting it as best I can. Uh, it should do the trick. We shall see what happens over time. Um, like this right here. Like that right there. Good thing that it's doing that. But uh, who knows? I mean, we want the water out. But uh, if it's going to just erode like that. Uh, but we'll see. It's kind of disappointing already. But uh, I think it looks a lot better. Um, and I'm almost done. Uh, I just have this little section to go right here. And then I'm done. And then we're gonna, I guess, go price out some sod. Let's see what we can do. To get some sod laid down in here. But, uh, I don't know. But, uh, I'm gonna finish up, guys. And you can watch me finish if you want to.
Alright guys, so that's all she wrote. It is done, complete. With this part, maybe needs to add a little bit more soil in some places, but for the most part, it's good. I'm gonna finish picking up these weeds right here uh, that I pulled, and uh, yeah, just clean off the rest of the sidewalk or the driveway, and uh, be done with it. It's time to finish this trench. Uh, we had some rain yesterday, which was great. Softened up the ground. And this clay, to have it softened up a little bit, is so much better than coming out here when it is hard as a rock. But uh, I'm going to get started, and I'm going to try to get this done. What do you say? All right. Hang tight. <music> Make sure you check your inventory. I thought I had a longer piece in that. And then I remembered I used it on that same place. But um, checklist, I gotta get the, the cap for that, the end. And then I gotta get a longer piece right there and take out that pop-up drain. And um, yeah, that's, that's all I got for today, guys. Nothing awesome, nothing sweet. Just digging, digging, and digging. All right, see you later. What is going on, everybody? Oh, look at this. I don't know if you can see. Let's see. Oh, look at this. Oh, soaked. Oh. No, I didn't jump in the pool because we don't have a pool. I've been working this morning. Jeez, uh, oh, it's hot. I'd take a little break to get some water, but... Uh, show you guys what I'm working on right now. All right, so I finally got a cap from a drain. And I finally got more product added. I took out my pop-up drain. Gonna save that for something else, maybe. Got my Y connectors here. And this is gonna flow all the way down. I'm almost done, guys. Whew. But I got back from Home Depot about an hour or so ago and now I just got to finish off this section right here and uh, I'll be all set what is going on everybody it, it feels a lot better the clouds are covering the Sun I am drenched with sweat and exhausted and it's not over yet oh man so got everything exactly where I want it what I need and I'm pretty happy about it. So uh, let's give it a look. So drain. Everything's filled in. Exactly the way I want it. Coming off to a curb. Curve. And coming down to my pop-up. With a whole bunch of concrete rock around it. So uh, I like so, it. Uh, that'll do the trick. I tell you. Everything is done. I'm, I'm happy about What is about going that? on everybody? So that was a horrible ending to that video. Uh, but just to kind of sum everything up, that was the process <coughs> of the drain back there for like three weeks. I just I have so many projects here that, <coughs> excuse me, I'm trying to get a hold of and do and get everything done. But um, as I was saying, everything is done. Everything is complete. Um, I like the way the side of the concrete over here, the driveway looks and uh, got the drain done. And I didn't show you, we had dirt we threw down. Uh, we just bought a, a few bags. Um, we'll need about maybe 30 more to finish off this side of the house, but I'll show you right now. So we planted these bushes. Uh, they were in the pots up in the front um, and they look great, really great in the morning time with those purple blooms coming in every morning, every morning. But uh. Yeah, just filled in a little bit here. It was way too low, but we're gonna take it all the way up, all the way up and all the way down, down to there. So 
Look at that lawn. Oh, baby. Looks good. He's going to get a mow job tomorrow, though. Look at the heat stress, man. It's hard to kill Bermuda, but the heat. This Texas heat can do it. Well, anyway, guys, I just wanted to give you a good send out instead of just cutting it off right there. So, uh, hope you guys have a great night, a great morning, or a great day whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you in my next video. And, uh, yeah. So, let's do it.